much, Justin. Hey, it's Wednesday. John Kesselmedes from the Las Vegas Review Journal is here uh, talking about a bunch of stories you've been writing about in your column called Cats. Cats. <laughs> and uh, something last night that you caught on camera, a, a benefit with, gosh, world-renowned DJs mm -hmm. here at Omnia uh, for yes. the victims of the shooting. But then there was a little bit of a surprise as well. At about midnight, uh, Celine Dion uh, came into the club and performed uh, My Heart Will Go On with Steve Aoki. Wow. And I'll tell you where she is. And it was bedlam, man. It was, uh, these are both artists are from Las Vegas. They're giants in their own industry and uh, they're fans of each other. And she came out and sang the full song. The place came apart. She danced with them a little bit at the end. And uh, this was un build but not necessarily unexpected there was some buzz around the the um, club there at caesars that she was going to show up but it was part of the what they called the benefit concert which had aoki wow. uh, cascade tiesto i interviewed him you'll see that in the column uh it just a cash cash was involved in this little john zed uh, big names indeed in the electronic dance music world Great. and uh, they raised i think a million dollars through this entire effort just from that show a lot of revenue and a lot of goodwill in that room last night. Yeah, an and it was incredible late. moment. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And then December 1st, like you said, there's going to be a big benefit at T-Mobile Arena, and mm -hmm. that has been officially confirmed with the Killers and Imagine Dragons, right? Yeah, Killers and Imagine Dragons, David Copperfield, Boys to Men, Penn mm -hmm. & Teller, Cirque Artists are all involved in this. And there are going to be more, too. So, and there's a great... Uh, it, December 1st was the, one of the dates we knew yeah. it was going to be a great deal of goodwill and of course Imagine Dragons and the Killers are local Las Vegas rock stars and mm -hmm. they uh, help put this whole thing together. Everybody's got their heart in, in Vegas on this yeah. thing so that's coming up at T-Mobile Arena. I think it's going to bring the strip together and people from outside. You know mm -hmm. people are already tweeting saying they're stars, excited. Yeah. All of them. Mm -hmm. All right so let's talk about this new show over at Caesars Palace at Cleopatra's Barge. It's just, I'm, I love the time of this. A, a five o'clock show. Five o'clock. Get yeah. it going. It's called the, ca the Cocktail Cabaret. Mm -hmm. Five o'clock from Wednesdays through Sundays at Cleopatra's Barge. And there's uh, Nikki Sclera, Eric Jordan Young, Daniel Emmett. That's Nicole Kaplan in that video. She's not going to actually be in the show. Marin Wade, mm -hmm. who's a terrific singer, also is going to be in the show. Um, uh, Nicole has a, another gig in Los Angeles that took her out of it. But this is a hyper talented show put on by Keith. Uh, Thompson and Philip Fortenberry, two composers and musicians in Las Vegas who know their way around a stage, yeah. and it's going to be a, a, a kicking show. Yeah, yeah, it sure is. And there was Marin, and that video, uh, they mm -hmm. wanted to make clear that's actually from another venue, not Cleopatra's Barge, because they haven't actually got video exactly. from Exactly. That, that was a showcase that they did, or a little segment at uh, the Myron's Cabaret Jazz in September. All right, and uh, 15 seconds, Whoopi Goldberg back at Treasure Island. I think she draws a lot an interest. She's on The View here, of course, Yeah, there she 13. is. I talked to her yesterday. She's turning 62 next week. It's her really? birthday show. She dates to, she told me some fun stories about Frank Sinatra's <laughs> advice to her. Frank Sinatra said, stay away from the, the uh, slot machines unless you can find a friendly one. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Golden nugget. But good she's advice. Great interview. Perfect. Great woman. Okay, good. We'll look forward to that. You can check out Katz's column, of course, online and in the review journal. It's called Katz. Katz.